there is a bee's nest around here somewhere and we're about to extract the uh, honey and uh, And apparently it's just under the wall, the bee's nest, <laughs> near where the rubbish bin is, at the bottom of the garden. This is Shambles Guru, Chris Smith in North Thailand in Chiang Mai. As you can see, the weather's lovely. And uh, I'm not sure how, how much of this I'm going to video because uh, they're very stingy bees. Sorry ladies and gentlemen, YouTube viewers, uh, I don't think I'm going to get too close to this. No protection is amazing. I actually thought bees and nests always put them high up in the trees in Thailand. In the videos they've been there. But these uh, bees have uh, put it in the bottom corner of the uh, garden, in the bottom of the wall. You can't actually see the uh, rubbish bin. There's a rubbish bin there, and the rubbish bin itself is interesting because it's made out of recycled tyres. So great for the environment. But we'll get a look at the honey that. <laughs> well, this is a sensitive outfit to wear, isn't it? But he wears this. He's one of the gardeners to the he comes uh, once a month or so to our house, and they uh, protect themselves from the sun like this all the time. Very sensible. <laughs> Oh dear. Oh, can you see them over there? Ooh, hoo, hoo. I'm not, uh, I don't know why I'm whispering. We'll see the honey curtain. Oh, here it is. Can you bring it out in the sun so it's easy to see? Oh, we have to take the. the, the oh. oh, you have to brush the bees away first, yeah? No, no sophisticated brushes in Thailand, just uh, take a leaf off the tree. <coughs> oh, and uh, I've seen this before. This is uh, the honeycomb. Put the honeycomb inside a muslin bag. And I think after that, it's just going to be squeezed down. Let me step back a bit here because uh, what I don't understand is why aren't the bees being more aggressive? There's a bit of smoke there to sort of uh, slow them down, but uh, <laughs> my wife actually said, I mustn't talk about that when we need the bees because then the bees will get angry and bite you and sting you. and. Uh, 
<laughs> I think that's why I'm talking softly. <laughs> How long has this nest been here? This uh, one month. But oh, they built all this in one month. Oh, wow. What's that now? <laughs> They're flying bees. I don't know if you could hear them buzzing around me then. So this is wax made of made of wax, isn't it? Yes. Straining the honey from the bees. Is that it? Finish? That's it. And here is the honey. Uh, this is how this is the total amount of honey, right? Two, one and a bit jars, yeah. And YouTube listeners have a smell. Mmm, smells like. Uh, yeah, smells like honey. This honey to be one month. One month and two days. So this was taken, this took the bees, well, were they bees or wasps? Bees. Bees. Took them one month to collect this. What will the bees do now? Huh? What will the bees do now? Uh, Over there in the corner of the garden. Do in there. In the I keep a little bit of comb, live in there. Yeah. Keep the comb for their statue again. And they'll be, we build it up again, yeah? yeah? I leave the small comb for them yeah. to do again. Lovely. Thank you for letting me video that.